this is Wesley from Synth City doing a quick tutorial today on how to record your own wavetables into the Waldorf NW1 wavetable module. The first thing you're going to need to do, obviously, is set up an audio signal to go into the NW1. So what I've done is I have a SM58 microphone running into the Dupfer A119 external input module. That is then running into the first modulation input on the NW1. So that's going to be your record input. So there are two basic controls to get going here. You want to switch your uh, bank select switch over to the record position, and then your switch for your modulation input. Um, I would leave that in the middle on brilliance for now. When you switch to the down position, it's going to actually arm it to record. So the first thing we'll do is we'll switch that over to the record functionality, and you're going to notice an audio difference here because the NW1 gives you a monitoring function. So I'm going to switch the mic and you can hear the differences. So now we're hearing through the Waldorf NW1. You'll notice a little bit different audio quality and some digital noise in there. A few things to set up before you get going. You have a level control. That's going to be your gain input. Um, we're going to leave it right where we've got it right now because it gives us plenty of headroom. Additionally, with your big red select function, you can set different modes for recording, kind of like sampling. Uh, you can set a threshold point based on different amounts of gain here, or you can set it to gate. Now, we're going to set it to gate because I can use a gate output from the A119 to start the recording. Additionally, you have the ability to select your record quality. which we'll set to high. And then you have a compression setting at the position knob, which compresses your incoming audio. We're going to put that in the middle. So let's get started with recording a wavetable. The input one switch will need to be pushed down to arm the recorder. From there, I will um, vocalize a little bit. And then at the end of it, I will switch over to the output of the NW1 so you can hear the results. Let's go. So I've got that wavetable I just recorded all patched up here with some modulation coming from the Make Noise Wired Wogglebug and the Make Noise Maths. So I'm going to bring in some modulation to the travel, the position, and the spectrum of the wavetable. You'll hear it cycling a little bit, and then I'll bring the modulation in after. And then I'll add a little bit of reverb from the Qubit RT60. Thanks very much for watching. This was Wesley from Synth City.